Mike. Hey, how are you, Mike? Good, good man. Good to see, good see, you. To see you. you. How are you doing? I'm good. I'm oh, good. good to see you today. Yeah. Beautiful day. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> I'm Mike Kenji with Level Up Mortgage, here today with Mark Palacio from eXp Realty. Hello. We're out of Agritopia today. Mark, tell us a little bit about Agritopia. Yeah, Agritopia is a you know, farming community, well once was a farming community, that has exploded into um, residential property over here in the high rises at the epicenter, um, retail shops, restaurants, bars, etc. And uh, the uh, the energy around this area is just amazing. It's absolutely beautiful. And then you have the beauty of the garden. Yeah, the and, gardens and the are just amazing. All Fresh food at the restaurants. I mean, uh, you know, from the from the farming, from the growth there. The, um, they just take it right from the farm. And I feel I, I feel like I remember diners, drive-ins, and dives being at Joe's Farm Grill. <laughs> <laughs> they were years ago. They were years ago. Very very successful. Very popular. Hey, Mike. I wanted to talk with you about what, what's going on in the market right now for, for rates and mortgage, and also what do you see in the forecast for the near future? Yeah, that's a great question, Mark. Um, we've seen actually a pretty good decrease in rates since the beginning of November. We're actually down a little over 1% I like that. from that time. <laughs> so we're kind of trending in that right direction. We, you know, A lot of people are talking about the Fed raising rates and how many times they've raised rates this yeah. year. Mortgage rates are really only loosely um, associated with the Fed funds rate. Actually, inflation numbers are what's really driven the rates up. So we've seen inflation come back a little bit, which is why we're seeing rates come back ah, a little bit. Okay. So okay. most of the pundits believe next year that the rates are gonna be back down into that low five, high four range. Um, Fannie Mae has said that, as well as some other financial pundits, and they think that could happen as early as the end of the first quarter next year. Okay, you know what's great about that is affordability. Absolutely. Right? Because if the rates come back down, then even if the prices aren't going down drastically, that will strengthen the affordability for buyers. 100%, okay. 100%. But okay. one thing that people do have to remember is that when rates go down, the demand is gonna go up. Yeah. So yeah. as that happens, they're going to start to see that maybe sellers are less negotiable on price, making repairs, giving concessions. Yeah. So it's still a great time to buy right now and oh. just always have a plan that refinancing is always an option. Great time to buy, but it's also a great time to sell too. And I'll tell yeah. you why. Anybody who bought a home uh, two years ago or later, you still you got tons of equity. Absolutely, tons of equity Absolutely. in your home right now. Absolutely, more equity than probably most people have realized in such a short period of time Absolutely. ever. Absolutely. So it, it, I agree with you. It's an excellent time to sell. Yeah. Absolutely. So Mark, from your perspective, how do you see the market right now? Okay, the market's the market's challenging right now. But of course, it's Christmas time, yeah. right? People are busy with other things. But I've got um, I've got buyers and sellers right now. Just put a total renovation home in the market, closing in two days. But I've got a buyer who needs to uh, move up to a larger size home and get a lot of attention on their on their home right yeah. now in Gilbert. So yeah. there's buyers out there, there's sellers out there, and a lot of times people are just waiting to see what's gonna happen. You know, the, the, the election is over now, yeah. so we've gotten past that. Yeah. And now it's all about, okay, are the rates gonna go up? Are they gonna go down? Uh, you know, what's inflation gonna do yeah. or, or that kind of thing. But I'm, I'm very optimistic and very positive about what's going on, especially after you telling me about what we expect for the rates in right. the new year. Well, and you've yeah. been in the business for a long time, long so time. I respect your opinion <laughs> yeah. on what you think is going to happen in 2023 with the real estate market. Same, likewise. Yeah. yeah. Like, you know, inventory right now is, is, is lower than it could be or should be, under 15,000. But what surprised me today is I was just looking at it a half an hour ago, and almost 5,300 homes are under contract. That's awesome. That's awesome. So, so people are still buying, people are still selling, maybe not at the same pace that you Exactly, expect, exactly. But it's still happening. Always going to happen. Oh, of course. Always going to happen. There's always reason to move. I, in my opinion, it is never a bad thing to buy a home because if, you, if you're in it for the long haul, yeah. and you have, you're going to get equity. Your home is going to increase in value over time. Yeah, and even as a lender, wouldn't you tell somebody who's buying a home right now, hey, listen, you buy a home right now, and the rates are a little bit higher than what you've been used to recently, if they go back down again, can you refinance? 100%, you there can you always go. refinance, and that should be part of the plan for anybody that buys a home right now, knowing that we've got more than just one potential loan. We might have to do this again soon, but it's only gonna to be to your benefit. If you can afford the home at this rate right now, imagine how happy you would be if we refinance at a lower rate and drop that payment. Totally agree. Well, Mark, it was so great meeting up with you today. It was awesome learning more about Agritopia. I didn't know 
a lot of the stuff you told me, so that's great. Great, yeah, great place. Come back, grab a bite to eat or a cup of coffee or hot chocolate or something over here. But uh, always great um, talking with you and, and uh, picking your brain about what's going on in the market. Yeah, absolutely. I feel like we always learn so much from each other whenever we have conversations. So. <laughs> yeah, I agree. <laughs>